Good afternoon, my name's John Spoda from the from Wild Love Mount Druid and I'm here to show you how to have a pedestrian faceway at Westfield Mount Druid and you can see a lot of people just walking in front of me are actually trying to get across to the traffic lights at uh, the east side of uh, Luxford Road and um, the ramp you just saw then is an inaccessible ramp for the wheelchair and electronic uh, chairs um, uh, community members. Now you, you will see here a lot of people just crossing here. Someone's actually blocked the uh, access way by putting a trolley there. So you'll notice me going a different way uh, because I don't, do not want to be fined. And there's the action, there's the phase where we're lobbying for. I'll turn here and I'll go for the traffic light here, walkway. And uh, you'll see there's some people coming from the western side who do actually walk across the phase walkway correctly. As I'm walking across, this, ro put the, this road needs a bit of fixing up here, as you can see here. I'll turn, I'm turning west at the moment, you can see, or heading west. Now heading north to the, to the phase walkway here on uh, the western side of the traffic lights. I will now have to walk across here and hopefully when I walk across here you'll be able to see how long the distance is. And look at that little lump on the road there. How the road's on, on level there. Uh, it's good to see that half the roadway has been attended to but the other half hasn't been attended to yet. As you can see, multiple cars are coming to and from. There's cars coming from the eastern side. And cars from, from the western side when they do. A lot of traffic is um, to enter. A lot of traffic enters the uh, entry of Westfield Mount Druid North. Here we are, we're just crossing the phased walkway here. Legally, which is pretty wide. Now we just turn right and uh, We'll be walking across this uh, phased walkway here. Oh, sorry, this footpath. So that way we can see how the uh, where the other phased walkway should be placed by council and by RMS. I mean, uh, New South Wales Roads and Maritime Services. Now, if the phased walkway was placed here, that's where it would have been. Now, R RMS is saying that they have to have a tree down. I do see that the, the uh, arms of the tree have been cut a little bit, so maybe they're getting ready for it. Um, finally, what I can say, this is the walkway to get to Shannon Walkway. The footpath to get to Shannon Walkway. What I can say is, what I discovered was that the, this, these fabric lines are put in by old laws where only one, where only three phase walkways could have been put in or two. But the new phase, but the new traffic lights need to have all phase walkways. So I now turn you back to where the potential phase walkway is. Two hundred dollar fine if you walk across there. Sorry, two hundred fifty dollar fine. So let's hope the council does change their attitude and also RMS.